What's good? It's your boy One coming at you once again. It's a late night, man. It's like 3 a.m. Your boy One doing his thing. So what you guys are staring at is my custom 1-6 scale. What is he? Jigsaw <laughs> from Saw Part 1. Now, if you guys aren't familiar with this guy, uh, this was the end scene where uh, he wakes up and you realize he was a mastermind behind the whole thing. He has a fake wound on his head, and I mean, this guy is highly detailed, man, extremely accurate, and it's just definitely an uh, awesome piece. Now, this is from a boy Saw fanatic. Uh, what better figure to do for him than a figure from Saw? So this is also my first ever Saw Custom, and I guarantee you guys it's not going to be my last now. Um, we can see the fake bullet wound on the side of his head. The face is crazy detailed. I sculpted that from scratch. Originally, my first sculpt looked like, uh, it looked like fucking <laughs> Bruce Willis, and so I had to go back after I painted and uh, sculpt, re-sculpt everything, and he's just fucking crazy realistic um he would have already been mailed out and uh you know what i mean but uh you know as i watched the movie a little closer i realized that he had a revolver in his hand and not this gun so i was hoping to get that gun this week i didn't get it so i'm just gonna mail this bitch out tomorrow and then when i get the gun i'll mail it to you dude so i mean this guy's a fellow cali boy so you know he'll get it in a, like in a day or two or whatever but so check that out you got this tape recorder right there uh, what's cool is, you know, we've got the display base, a little larger, and, um, the stand or whatever, and we've got the, uh, tiles, if you can see closely, the blood splatter, so if you want to lay this guy down and reenact the scene from the film. We also have the doctor guy's, um, <laughs> foot, from when he cut his foot off, so he could escape, and, um, real metal chain, real metal shackle, uh, of course the foot is removable. And, uh, you know, it's not just like a regular foot that I broke off of a figure. I actually had to sculpt this heel right here, ankles, all the little lines and details in the toes and in the back of the foot. So, uh, you know, I did some work on this foot just to make it a little more realistic. It's also dirty, like, you know, homeboy was just chilling there all night, you know, whatever. I don't know how long he was there, but... So, uh, you just put this bitch back on. Oh, it's upside down. You kind of got to put it the right way. I also won't fit correctly. Uh, it's hard to do this with one hand, but hey, I got a lot of time to waste, no problem. So you just pop this bitch right there, boom. Very sexual. So there you go, my first ever Saw custom figure, and definitely not my last, guys. So if you're interested in one of these motherfuckers, hit me up. Uh, it's my boy Saw Fanatic for this one. This is his right here. Um, also, I have um, this. This right here. American Me and Empire, those are cool movies anyway. But uh, this is from my boy JR A Nightmare. What up, man? This is your custom six inch scale Marvel Legends uh, Demon Freddy. Now, the hand is, you know, I mean, not complete. Uh, it was complete, and it is complete, but at the same time, you know, I'm fucking with it. I'm a perfectionist, man. So, you know, it'll be ready to go, though. Um, check that out. Real Metal Blades, uh, you know what I mean? He'll do a review on it. I wish you guys could see. This was actually made out of a, a black Spider-Man figure from the Red Hulk series of Marvel Legends. So, of course, the hat's removable. So, you guys know that the face is <laughs> sculpted over a Spider-Man head. So, there's no features that were previously used. And I have a bad camera, but just know that the fucking teeth are on the side, the pointed ears. Sculpted sweater, sculpted pants. I mean, it's a motherfucking beast right here. I got the hat from... Uh, the spirit figure from Mexico, so it fits actually perfect. So look forward to a review for that. Shout out for J shout out to JR A Nightmare. He's also a fellow Cali native. You know what I'm saying? Um this right here is my uh well, I didn't make it but this is mine. Uh if you guys aren't familiar with R. Lee, handmade horror, fucking crazy, crazy customizer guys fucking very talented and I had done a review on this figure but you know my computer crashed I had it all edited out but uh redoing it so I look forward to a review a full review on this fucking masterpiece so I'll leave a link in the description for his work so you can check him out um but yeah man you know what I'm saying that's pretty much it guys it's a late night man you know your boy one gotta get back to work but uh 
check this out. I actually re-sculpted the face on this. The guy, I think he's on vacation, man, so... Still need to get paid for this bitch, man. So, I don't know if you guys are interested, man. If I ain't get paid for this by next week, he will be available for sale. I'm gonna probably add a little sack head to him and... You know what I'm saying? I redid the hockey mask. Look, it's fucking demented. <laughs> so, yeah, guys. Your boy One doing it big. Um, your boy Wonder, so, uh, shout out to, uh, Saw Fanatic, uh, JRA Nightmare, of course, my boy Beta 2G, <laughs> this is later, man, we'll get to that some more, and, uh, you know, shout out to all my subscribers again, man, uh, I very much appreciate the love, man, and, uh, you know, I've been getting hit with a few haters here and there, but, uh, other than that, it's all good, I just definitely need people to make sure and understand that, you know, I don't sit at home all day, you know what I mean, dedicate my life to this. Now, I do love doing it, and uh, I work very hard at what I do, guys. But at the same time, I have kids. I have a 5-year-old. I got a 6-year-old. I got a 2-year-old. I got a family. I got things and responsibilities to take care of. So I don't always have time to get back to you guys or, you know what I'm saying? I mean, they're just. I just definitely need you guys to understand where I'm coming from. I got people sitting, waiting on projects, you know what I'm saying, for me, who kicked out a hell of a lot of a dough, you know what I'm saying, so definitely people who uh, I got big deals like that with got to come first, but at the same time, man, I look out for the homies, the people that I know are real, you know what I'm saying, so uh, just want to let people know that, you know what I mean, I do have a life outside of this, so, you know what I mean, you, <laughs> you haters out there better calm down, so that's all, you know what I mean, and respect what I do, and, and, and I know that this is not all it. I can't even do all the videos I want to do right now. But, uh, you know what I'm saying? That aside, uh, again, man, much respect and love to all my people who know what's good. But, uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm out, guys. This is later, man.